is general reading, this may or may not resonate. Okay, if it doesn't, check out your other placements. If you need a personal reading, all that information is going to be below. All right, Cancer. What I'm getting here is right off the bat that you walked away. Okay, you're you've emotionally detached from this person here. You found the emotional strength and you walked away from this person. This person here seems to have a reality check. Okay, maybe this person was living in the dream world. I'm getting here someone who had to make a choice. Okay, this person here had to make a choice out. You know, pick your size. Okay, you could definitely be the person on this side, and this could definitely be the person that uh, you're dealing with. Okay, just pick and choose how it resonates. Right now, there is a lack of commitment here, okay? There's a lack of stability, security, and commitment between you both, okay? Something's just not getting into fruition here. Um, I feel like you're both at the end of the cycle out here, okay? So it's like either the marriage or the commitment happens or it doesn't happen at all and you walk away. And that's exactly what's happening. You're walking away because there is no stability here. With the Seven of Cups in reverse, I feel this person out here thought they had like forever to take, to pick and choose what they wanted. Maybe they had a lot of options here. But this person out here seemed to be someone, you know, who was taking their own sweet time to make a decision about you. Okay. And uh, I think you waited for this person for a very long time to pick you, to make a choice, you know, or to just let you know what they really, really wanted with you. Okay, but I feel that they didn't do that and you had like no choice but to walk away from this person out here. I feel this person here um, could have had a lot of distractions also. Okay, uh, but we'll clarify that. I feel... Um, you view this person as someone who you don't want drama with. Okay, I feel you've let this thing go because there was too much of chaos, too much of uh, conflicts and too much of, um, you know, uh, bickering and arguments between you both. You guys were just not getting on the same page. Uh, there could have been a lot of interference from other people also between you both. And you were like, you know what, screw it. I can't do this anymore. So yeah, you just like walked away from this conflict out here. You Either this person had too many options and they put you in a place where you always had to compete for their attention or compete for, you know, uh, being holding a spot in their life. So you just gave up. You're no longer wanting to fight for this. This person with the six of pentacles here, this person probably views you as someone who uh, is a giver. You know, you're someone here who is a giver, who's very, very generous. Okay. Uh, this person here could be seeing you as someone here, you know, who they would want commitment with also. So they do view you as someone who's probably very generous. All right. And very supportive, very giving, you know, and uh, more like uh, a very supportive lover. That's how they view you. And I guess now they regret losing you. Ace of Cups in reverse is the mutual energy, which means both of you all are shut down emotionally. Both of you all uh, are probably holding a grudge, but you all had a very rough patch in your life. Okay, both of you are here. I feel you've already ended the relationship with this cancer, with this person out here. Whilst this person is like, you know, I mean, what the hell is going on? But right now you're both not being able to open up to each other. So there looks like there is no communication between you both. Emotionally, you both are shut off. The root of the issue is the queen of the one, queen of wands in reverse. You know, this could be another woman here. Okay, this could be another person out here. Okay, someone who's very dominating and having a very strong control over you, a strong control over the person you're dealing with. We'll find out. But queen of wands in reverse is usually another person out here. But otherwise, it could just be you, or someone being very, very dominating out here. Okay, just dominating, jealous, possessive, insecure. You know, stuff like that. Your actions with the Wheel of Fortune here, I feel you are ready to get the ball rolling out here. I feel you're ready to walk away from this person here. You're trying to have a more positive aspect. And it's like whatever changes have happened between you both after the breakup, you're ready to take things forward and move forward in a positive direction. It's more like you feel this was a very destined thing to happen, okay? And, um... You know, it's like from your side, I get more of that acceptance. You know, it's like, well, it is what it is. And I just got to do what I got to do. You're no longer resisting any changes out here, okay? You are making a very decisive, there's a decisive moment out here. Things have been unexpected between you and this person out here, okay? But your relationship is probably changing here and you're making adjustments and trying to move forward. The person you're dealing with, right? That's your feelings out here. The person you're dealing with is the king of cups here. So this person has a lot of love for you, okay? But they're still not taking any action towards you. So this person now, ha now has their shit together here after they had clarity about what they really wanted. After you walked away, they got the clarity that they wanted you. Hmm. Nice. So uh, this person has a lot of love for you, okay? They do. 
the action you plan on taking is i think you plan on to moving forward and keep looking on towards the future here because you have no time to invest into someone who's not and the same page with you and who's just not ready to give you what you want honestly i feel you're more focused on your career or more focused on your business or something like that rather than focusing on wanting to make a relationship work out this person out here has so much to say they have so much to tell you okay but they're just holding back and because they're holding back they're probably missing a lot of opportunities here this person has a lot of fear okay of what they want to say they're constantly doubting themselves okay second guessing themselves which is why they're missing opportunities out here the outcome here between you both is the world you so there is a cycle that you both are closing okay there is an ending here but the ending is bring new beginnings i'm about to start clarifying let's see why is the eight of cups here High priestess here. There could have been something that was revealed to you, which finally made you, you know, it's like made you uh, force, it kind of forced you to make a decision to walk away or whatever was relieved. Either there was a truth that was being re revealed or there was some secret that came out or there was some information that you got or there was just some kind of clarity that you got, which was like, yeah, okay, like an aha moment and I need to walk away. Seven of cups in reverse, what's that? Nine of Swords in reverse. Wow. This person out here is a very negative thinker. See, they're very overwhelmed right now. They're so overwhelmed. They have no fucking clue what the hell is going on. This person does not know how to make a choice. You know, this is someone here who's very, very, very bad at making choices. You know, and I think with the Nine of Swords in reverse here, this person here is, you know, they're in a very, very bad position right now is what I'm getting here. This person could be going through a lot of trauma. All right and um it's like they have clarity about the situation probably that you walked away but i feel this person here could have a lot of mental health issues here okay they're trying to find help they have a lot of guilt but they're learning to cope is what i'm getting here okay what's the ten of pentacles in reverse what's the ten of pentacles in reverse ten of pentacles in reverse that in reverse, yes. Yeah, yeah. Even though, even though there is no commitment between you both, and probably the relationship has come to an end here, this person is not ready to let you go, or you are not ready to let them go here. Someone here has still not cut the connection off completely. Okay, this person here refuses to let you go. Okay, they're not gonna let you go, they're not, and they're not even going to change. So yeah, they want to keep the cycle going on whilst you probably are pretty much done with them. Five of Wands in reverse. Why is that? Yeah. See, you're not doing anything about it here. You feel like this is a sacrifice that is important, that is needed out here, okay, in order for you to move forward in your life, okay? Because this is too much drama. This person brings in too much drama in your life. And for right now, you're just like, you know what? I'm done and um, you're no longer investing into them. You feel probably this is a connection that you shouldn't be investing. It's bad investment. But yeah, you're not doing anything about it. For you, it's like, like I, I told you, right? This is more like an acceptance from your side. But it's like you're just letting go. You know, you're no longer wanting to fight the odds out here. Okay. You probably did feel very stuck and restricted in your life. Okay. You realize that what was holding you back and what was holding you back is this connection of this person here. This is someone who is preventing you from moving forward here. Okay. So you're just surrendering and letting go. Right. You're no more longer resisting your current circumstances. You're accepting them and allowing yourself to flow with life. Okay. Uh, what's the Six of Pentacles? What's the Six of Pentacles? Uh, the devil in reverse here. This person probably sees you as someone, you know, who's released yourself from this connection out here. Okay. They knew that this was a very strong connection out here. You both were very, very strongly tied to each other here. But with the devil here, it was a very toxic connection here. Okay. So they see you as someone here who has probably, you know, you could have even gone ahead and got engaged and married to someone else. That's also what I'm seeing here. Maybe you're giving to someone else. Okay. You're giving your attention to someone else and not them. Or probably you're giving them the attention and along with that, giving someone else attention. So probably they feel you're giving to two people together out here, okay? But with the devil in reverse here, they probably feel that this is a connection which is which was toxic and you've let it go or they've let it go. What's the ace of cups in reverse here? Ace of cups in reverse. Why is ace of cups in reverse here? Um, so you're both just in denial. That's what oh, that's what's happening here. This is the mutual energy. I feel you're both kind of very confused. 
right both of you are very confused and i feel that instead of um, you know instead of um how do i say this um instead of addressing the issue instead of addressing the issue i feel you're both going just very very busy being closed off emotionally to each other very busy in your own lives trying to stay very busy in your day to day activities so that you don't have to think about what really went wrong in the connection that's what i'm getting and you both have given up here if it's a long distance relationship you both feel it's a failed long distance relationship the strength in reverse had to show its face see you're both tired of dealing with the situation no one's making the effort here to try and get back to each other queen of wands in reverse so why is that here why is the queen of wands in reverse Reverse. Yeah, I think uh, you're trying to heal. I think you're trying to heal from the situation here. Okay, you're being passive. You're not taking action anymore because this person made you feel very, very insecure, very unprotected in this connection out here. And I think you're just trying to move on. You're just releasing yourself from the situation. No longer wanting to work at it. Three of Swords and Reverse is also the card of you know just wanting to heal, forgive, and move on. And I think that's what you're doing here. With the hangman here. Uh, what's the wheel of fortune? Because see, there's a lot of moving forward from your side. Okay. What's the wheel of fortune here in your feelings? What's the wheel of fortune here in your feelings? Cancer. Yeah, see, you're moving on, babe. You're moving on. That's what I said. You're okay. Well, you're done with this. It's just too much drama. And that's the last thing that you want in your life. So... That's what's happening here. You're just ready to let this go. No longer wanting to hold on to it. If it doesn't make you happy, you don't have any time and energy to invest in it anymore. Some of you may even have gone ahead and got engaged or just started dating or just, you know, got into a relationship with someone else because that's how they view you as giving to two people here. But you're moving forward here. Okay, You're being very, very practical and realistic out here. And in your feelings, it's like you want to move forward. Okay. You want to, it's like you think that's the right thing to do. And it's destiny. And you're accepting the change that has happened in this relationship. Whether it's a breakup, separation, whatever it is, you're accepting it happily and you're just going with the flow. King of Cups here in this person's feelings. Why is the King of Cups here? Why is the King of Cups here? <laughs> they want to talk. They want to talk with the page of wands here. They're not happy without you. Ten of cups in reverse. They're just going to break up. This person is not happy without you at all. They want you. They need you. You were there happily, there, there happily ever after. And now they want to talk. Depends on whether you want to talk to them or not. That's just up to you here. But this person definitely wants to talk. They want to come towards you with some passionate communication. They've had a new approach of how they can come towards you. But this person's probably isolated themselves. They're very unhappy without you. Very unhappy. You got their wish come true. And now they want to talk to you. Now they got their shit together, finally, after you moved on. But you clearly don't look like you want to talk to them because with the Queen of Swords, you're ready to chop this person's head off let's see queen of swords that's your action why is the queen of swords here why is the queen of swords here seven of wands yeah see your cards are up babe. your cards are up you are least interested in this person you're giving up you're turning your back to this person you already have i feel a lot of you have completely moved on to another relationship is also what i'm getting here your you your defenses are up okay you don't trust this person you don't want to get to this person you don't want this person anywhere close you've just isolated yourself or you're just guarding yourself okay I think you're just uh you could have blocked this person on social media or energetically blocked them okay it's like stay away you know like just just back off is what i'm hearing from your side here you're just not interested in them knight of swords in reverse is that action here why is that hmm. see this person's a coward is what i'm getting here could be someone who's a player could be a cheater could be someone who is a commitment phobe here but this person has love here so i won't say that this person is a cheater uh, but i would say that this person here lacks the initiative this person lacks the courage 
they lack the confidence in making that decision to come towards you and make things happen this person is very very laid back you know they're not taking the initiative they don't have the balls to come towards you or just you know come towards you and just like like hey i love you you know like let's just make this happen they're lacking the courage they're still not being able to take the lead role out here okay they feel very powerless and it's a very that's like a very weak person out here okay compared to you and which is why you're quite fed up but the world here i feel there's an ending here you're closing the chapter with this person what's the world here what's the world what's the world this person you know they they lack the daring you know that they're not being able to make that bold daring decision out here the world here what's the world why is the world here is the outcome Page of Swords. Yeah, see, this person here, they just got to keep watching you from a distance. They're thinking on what to tell you, what to keep telling you. But I think you're off. You're out with the Empress in reverse here. You're no longer feeling this connection because you feel it's going nowhere. Whatever you do, no matter how much you try to go away, this person is still on your ass, okay? They're not going to let you go. You can have your defenses on here. But this person out here is just ignoring the situation for right now. eventually i feel they will come towards you because they're still watching you they want to communicate with you they have a lot of love for you but the only part here is which is the fucked up part and the most important part is where's the action buddy knight of swords reverse king of wands reverse all the cards are saying like they're like just holding back they're holding back completely if they would have not held back and if they would have you know tried to take control of the situation and showed a little bit of boldness and a little bit of daring and you know like that uh, a little bit of um bravery things could have worked out even better here okay but right now i feel that this person here is just um they they have control issues this person wants to control the relationship i don't feel there is any relationship anymore between you both here but i feel this person is just trying to you know um hold the relationship in a way they can okay by probably forcing you or putting like you know pressurizing you in some sort or trying to just teach you a lesson or just trying to hold back trying to play games or something like that out here you know that's a very bossy lover is what i get very bossy but they're not taking any action so it's not going to move forward okay so that's what i have for you hope this reading resonates leave your comments below and i'll see you next time bye bye